Hey guys, and welcome back to Avorian, an amazing space simulator 4x ship building wonder of a game. I'm not sure how to describe this game. If you guys have a better idea, let me know. Last time we made a giant trek across most of, well, I mean, across a very small section of the galaxy at the bequest of a quest, asking us to go from here to deliver some, uh, some oxygen down below. We did that and we found ourselves some combat. It wasn't any combat that we could get involved because, of course, we are weak, weak, weak. But we did have a look at the system defenses going around and holding this place down killing the various pirates etc and we went round and got as many different bits of salvage as we could and look there's another one over there that's going to give me the opportunity to fly into it let's go over there and grab it hello bam bam and we can then come into one of our menus here in the, uh, in the P, the ship's menus, you can go to systems, and as I have previously explained, we have slots for our systems. Now, we picked up these systems, and one of the first things I definitely want to put in here is turret control. This one that means that I can now put extra turrets in. If you have a look, turret control system, common, arm turret slots, plus one. Beautiful. It's exactly what I want. It's what we're going to go for. I am not sure what the permanent installation means. I, I've not even got onto that, but we're going to do that. The other thing that we've got here is a shield booster or a radar upgrade. Now, the, the deep scan range would be nice. It, uh, it will enable us to have a look at this map. And you can see these um, green dots around. Uh, it's uh, how far those green dots affect us. Look at this here without the grid. Why does this not have a grid? Maybe we're going to go over this way and find out. Uh, but actually, no, what we're going to do is take this wormhole. But anyway... Um, the green scan would be nice, but what we're actually going to do is put the shield booster on there, because I just feel like that will be better for our ship in general. We were going around and we were having a look at some combat, and I feel like some more combat is already and waiting for it. Look, there's another one just over there. Hey, what are you doing? Give me, give me that. What, what have we got? Uh, that is a C43 object detector. No idea. Uh, but as I was saying, we, we were going around, we were looking for combat, but I think there is more exciting things for us to go and look at, and that is, of course, through this wormhole. Pleased to report that it looks like most of the stations have stopped their glitchy bouncing around the the asteroids. Uh, I'm I'm working under the theory at the moment that the bouncing uh, bouncing stations were literally bouncing off asteroids. Could be a thing, might not be. I don't know. I don't know at all. Now, of course, we have our little mining vessel. Where is he? There he is over there, going around and still doing wonders for us. I'm going to leave him here because, as I say, we might end up facing combat, and I I don't want my little mining ship that can't even turn around properly to uh, to go. Out and face that. I am expecting because this wormhole looks like it's taking us quite a distance across the galaxy, that we're probably going to end up finding something that's a little bit more uh, hectic than we were originally intending. I don't want to burn my battery out by uh, by flying over there too quick because I might need it on the other side. Uh, so yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna drift on over to here, and I will see you when we get. I don't even know how long. I can't I can't select the wormhole with my. Uh, with my with my select my radar my you know what is this thing over here dice uh, so we're just kind of gonna have to flow into it. it it looks like it's a lot closer than it actually is it doesn't seem to be growing or shrinking as I get closer maybe we are now going through the the, the ruffled area of space time the, the a small volume of space that is going to take us a lot longer to cross than we thought okay here we go in we go and we are all the way on the other side. Hey, uh, we've got the adventurer hailing you. I will do that, but first I want to have a quick look. Literally other side of the map. Literally other side of the map. Anyway, yes, I wish to answer this. Hi there, how are you doing? Um, I'm doing well. I see that you uh, started to venture out. As soon as you started to do that, the second ship came in very handy. I've got a second ship, thanks very much. In order to command another ship, you need a captain on it. I've got one. Look at this. What is this? What is this? What is this? For training purposes, I'll lend you one of my ships that has already had a captain. Please don't damage it. All right, cool. That's that's wicked. Uh, there. Now, open the strategy mode with F9 and order the Lady Adventurous to fly closer to you. Okay, we can definitely do that. Nine. Uh, lady Adventurous, come over here, please. All right, thanks. I'm a little bit worried about what the bandit is. Let's, uh, I mean, is, is he going to take this down? Is this going to be something that we even get to have an eye on? Uh, I can't really go and have a look. We can see the combat going on over there. Okay, is, is it something to worry about? What happens if he dies during combat? 
is uh, like mm, you know what I'm saying the, the, let's have a look down here somewhere in here there should be something called an Omicron value and that shows us how um, powerful it is though it doesn't look like we've got one here I mean this guy doesn't seem to be taking any damage so there's no problem right is this a sector without even a, a, a gate system in it okay that's cool that's very cool I can't swing the map round unfortunately I'm not sure what's going on with that Oh, we have done it. Now that you know how to give orders to the ship in the same sector. I went and started looking through menus because it was taking so long to get over here. Let's try issuing orders to a ship in other sectors. The possibility is endless. For now, but for now, just let the Lady Adventurers jump to the Mark sector and immediately return. Uh, oh, oh, remember, you can do something. Keep in mind that other ships and stations delay the hyperspace recharge. If they're hostile, they may even try to disturb your recharge, which will result in longer recharge time. Okay, that's cool. All right, so they were saying, hey, we should give this guy an order to... To disappear somewhere else so we're gonna click on the the the, the lady here attack escort mine somewhere in here is the one we want okay so we seem to be missing the actual jump command here i'm not sure if it's the thing that i need to uh to, to give or not so i'm gonna try just moving this over to there i've clicked did that did that not work it turns out that did not work I right clicked, did that work? So I, I clicked on here, right clicked. I'm hoping now that we're gonna watch this, woo, disappear. Yeah, all right, beautiful. Okay, that's a lot easier than having an extra command to tell it to do something. Uh, so once it's gone over there, are we gonna get another update? Oh, I attempted to go and have a look at this. Um, it, it, either of these having a bad time. Doesn't look like it. You can switch to another sector that contains one of your crafts. Right click on the target sector and s select switch to sector, okay. Right click. Is, is this really what I want to do? I don't think that's really what I want to do. What I actually want to do is click on you and tell you to come back because that's what the mission says, right? That's totally what the mission says. Ah, there's our lady. Now you know how to command your fleet. You can keep the lady adventurous and her crew. Oh, yeah. I hope she can show you just how useful a fleet can be in this vast galaxy. I'm off to look for a way to cross the Great Barrier. I'll see you. All right, thanks, thanks very much, buddy. Uh, has he just disappeared and left us in a hostile area? Uh, I want to go order, order, escort me. Uh, um, are, are you are you about to try and move in on you? Are we about to find out that there is danger and hostilities in this world and that we don't feel great about it? Okay, we, we're going to have to try and get in. That, the Lady Adventurous doesn't have any weapons. We were just being told that. Actually, what I want to do, uh, is it here? One of these menus has the ability for me to put more turrets on my ship. Yeah, here we go. I don't think we've got any more turrets right now, though. Oh, that, that also does uh, kind of suck. Is he still coming at me? 35 34 yeah okay definitely coming down what about you over there uh oh we, we are we are in the trouble as they say as they say so my big question here is do i just dive for the wormhole and hope that the lady adventurers can follow me or do we try and take this one down unfortunately it's not a case of we can save and reload it's not that type of game guys it's not that type of game i'm, I'm feeling like i might try and just back out slowly all lady adventurers coming at us pretty quick there um maybe maybe if we had some more guns and stuff i would be up for it oh we are gonna get in trouble anyway aren't we all right let's go let's do let's let's just get out of here shall we i really 12 kilometers i you know what i might i might just i might just go and have a crack at it what's the worst that could happen guys i have to restart this episode all over again no okay seven six i don't know i don't know what my target range is i don't know how much combat this thing can give off i don't see any like to hit markers do you guys see any to hit markers? Where am I supposed to be shooting? All right, that that's it. I'm out of here. I am out of here. Maybe maybe we need to get ourselves a what's the word that I'm looking at? like a targeting computer? Some something like that would be great because at the moment I feel like I'm shooting from miles away. Okay, yeah, let's let's go out and uh, hopefully he'll follow me. Like that that would be great. Take him home, right? So we have a way of exploring the galaxy. It just leads to a bit of middle of nowhere. Okay, big question I've got. Your craft is under attack. Is she coming through? That's the big question. Is she coming through? Can we check the map and find out? Oh, it's all the way over here. We're never going to find out. Uh... Okay, according to this, there is only one ship in that wormhole. I'm guessing that's because we've got all our ships down here now? Or are they all... Yes, all our ships are here. Beautiful. Wonderful. Look, here, here it is. I don't know what I'm going to do with this. It's a big ship. And it's just going to do nothing but follow me around. Okay, fair enough. Okay, well, we'll take a little bit of downtime. I remember last time we picked up this triple point defense chain gun turret. That sounds like something I want to stick on top. You must place the turret on a block made of titanium or better. 
We could totally do that. The way that I'm going to go about doing that is to highlight this little iron armor front place here and um, highlight the titanium armor and go, hey, can you replace that? And that should, hopefully, have gone and fixed that for us. So now we go and click this, click that, boom. Beautiful. What's it saying that the problem is? Not enough crew members. Okay, so here is the problem. We got ourselves a bunch of mechanics miners, but we've only got four out of six gunners. So we need to go and find somewhere to go and do that. All right, get me out of this build menu and let's go and find somewhere that sells some gunners. I haven't moved around these systems before. I'm going to start with the resource, resource depot down below there. Hire the crew, see what we got here. Gunner? Security, borders, not quite what I'm after. We could get some general crewmen, but let's try some other places. Is there a shipyard around? That's kind of the next thing I want to look at. Now, according to this, we've got a trading post that might have what we're after, but mostly it's just mines, and I don't believe mines do crew. Hire crew, beautiful. Any gunners? Security, gunners. All right, we can go over to there. Let's, let's go find that place. Where are you? My beautiful little resource depot. There it is, right in front. It's not a resource depot, it's a trading post. Low, 100 kilometers away. Woo. We say 100 kilometers, woo, but of course, in space, 100 kilometers is literally right next door. Hey, yes, you are now talking to the automated interaction system of the trading post. What can we do for you? Well, I want to hire some crew and I want to hire... Was it just two gunners? I think it was indeed just two gunners. Oh, no, no, my number pad doesn't work. All right, no worries. We'll just take those, though. No problem. Come out of here. Don't try and slam our engines up against the ship. Find the right button and uh, 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 assign those two crew. Oh, we got seven out of six. Oh, that's even better. All right, beautiful. Oh, that uh, C43 object detector that we picked up earlier in the episode detects claimable asteroids and flight recorders. Displays notif notifications when interesting items are detected. And I think that might be something we want to do if we can get... Oh, I was about to say if we can get our processing, but pirates are attacking, so let's go and check out what's going on over there. Am I even am I even gonna have or oh, 40 kilometers away the uh, the speed to go and get involved? I don't know. Oh, there are definitely people trying to fight Major Dom, please come in. It's a reference to a music. Aha. Alright, I'm gonna try and get in there and see what's going on. Maybe I'll get to fight, maybe not. It seems a little deadly to actually do so. Hopefully we'll just be able to see where the uh, the clouds of debris end up. Look at this guy, he is just getting pwned all over. Yeah, okay, alright, we're gonna to have to try and get in as quick as possible to get that debris. Oh, please don't. <laughs> One day I will just co totally smash into uh, to an asteroid at full pelt and I'll be like no ah, look there's there did you see that and and some stuff under here all right let's start by uh oh, blue what is the blue chain gun turret oh yeah well now what else have we got the green over here also important well I don't know about important but a triple chain gun turret beautiful beautiful obviously this game follows the same sort of standard um sort of token system of the colors. You know, white's the worst. I think purple's the best. We'll find out. Yellow actually probably is the best with the uh, the old legendary status or whatever. Okay, so we've picked up a bunch of rubbish from this salvage operation here. Let's jump over into our Lady Adventurous. Woohoo, hi, how you doing? I am Lady Adventurous. Uh, and we're gonna go into the ship menu here. I'd say ship menu. What I actually wanted to do was go to the build screen and then we can start figuring out what weapons we're going to put on this because there appears to be a shocking lack. Shocking lack of weapons on this. So let's try and do that. What, what have we got over here? What is this? It's an iron turret base. Oh, are these all turret bases up front? Oh, beautiful. So there's a whole bunch of places to put stuff like that. But all, literally all I've got is a... A chain gun turret, rare, that's pretty good. Salvage turret, there's another triple chain gun turret. Okay, let's put let's put this one on the side here. No, actually, let's put this nice chain gun turret right on the top like that. Beautiful, beautiful. Okay, two chain guns up front. We've got a blue chain gun turret and a green triple chain gun turret. That should hopefully allow us to uh, open this and have a look. Ooh, we've got some scraps in here. Ooh, we'll have to go and try and deal with that at a resource depot. But over here, I should be able to, like, turn these on to number one. And more importantly, we need four gunners, so let's go find them. Oh, we can take care of both our scrap... Oh, does this mean this is carrying cargo and that I can go and pick up some of this titanium that appears to be around. I sure do hope so. Let's rearrange this camera a bit. Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, oh, I totally can pick up a whole bunch of material here. I wonder if there is a salvage in this sector um, order. That was something we used to be able to do back in the good old days of X. You used to be able to buy a cheap, terrible little ship that you didn't care about and go, hey, go around and salvage everything you can find in this sector. You just wait for people to attack and it'll go around, not get involved. 
do all the wonderful stuff. Anyway, as I was saying, let's go to the resource depot. Woo we I thought the grandest entrance was closed. This is a uh, slow, sluggish ship, I think is the way to describe it. Also, travels half the speed of the grandest entrance. We might have to try and do something about this at some point. Oh, this ship is so slow. Anyway, we are here and we want to have uh, a few gunners, right? A few gunners. Do we not actually have gunners here anymore? Oh, no. All right, let's, let's stop flying around in that tiny, tiny ship. Uh, what it turns out, what I actually needed to do was, of course, go to the trading post, not... Not to the resource depot. <laughs> hey, hey, what do we have here? You're not what I thought we were heading towards. Mobile planetary merchant, how are you doing? Please interact. Hello, you are speaking to the automated interaction system of the planetary trading post. How can we help you? Uh, give me all your, no, trade goods. Tra Wait, there's more? What's to your home sector? Let's try, let's try with the trade goods first. Let's see what he's got. Carbon, helium, hydrogen, nitrogen. Are we wanting to sell anything to him? No, no, not at all. Uh, more importantly, what, what else do you have? Cargo licensing? What you got? Illegal, stolen, suspicious, and dangerous. Okay, that's, that's the same selection as last time. Where is your home sector? Uh... Q Prime is at this place. All right, nice. If I now go um, and click on this, yeah, all right. Okay, that's that's pretty cool. That shows me this sector here. Oh, such a small area that we've explored. Still feels massive. Tiny, tiny area. Tiny area. Do want to go and check out whatever this is. Oh, it definitely belongs this way. I think the trading post is probably the station with the most sort of character to it, if you ask me. Like, the mines, they definitely uh, conjure up the, 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 the look of a mine, if you will. They definitely hit the, the, the right look. But it's just, it's not quite got the character that this guy has, you know? All right, I'm going to come over to here and use the tractor beam. But I don't actually want to use this with you. Did I just crash into that? Did I, did I really just crash into that? What I want to do is control with uh, over there. Can I use you? Looks like not. What I want to do is use Lady Adventurous over here. Hi, how you doing? Greens, you are now talking to the automated interaction system. Yeah, I just want the higher crew. Uh, was it two of these I think we wanted or was it four? Let's go and find out first quickly. It was four. It was four. Okay, so with that all in, I have just been told that someone in a sector, is it in this sector, is having trouble? Let's go and have a look. I mean, so yeah, I mean, there is definitely trouble in the sector over there, but I don't think we're going to have any trouble with it. Oh, look, there is a salvage option in the in the whole list of things. All right, escort me, my glorious little adventurous lady. Uh, we are going to go and find out if we can finally take on that pirate that we were looking at. Well, I've got two ships now, one one that I can control di directly and one behind me with some guns. So I'm going to just fly slowly but surely towards this ear wormhole in front of me and hopefully we can go take down the pirates. Why do I only have one type of gun up front? Oh, we have just been told my mining ship cannot find any more asteroids. Not a problem. Not a problem at all. We'll, de we'll, we'll deal with it in a second after we've come back. And then I think we'll just start moving. Wow. I say I want to move towards the center of the galaxy, but you know we're not going to, right? Okay, with Lady Adventurers having caught up, we're now going to try and go through this wormhole. And if, if it is exactly as we left it... Then there will not be a ship. There will be a ship on the other side here. But if it is continued with the simulation, maybe that ship has disappeared off somewhere else. I don't know which which side that's going to be, but we we will find out. It could be either one of those two scenarios there. Once again, wormhole a little bit further away than it looks. I don't want to go too fast because, of course, I am faster than Lady Adventurous over here, and uh, with her being the uh, the computer controlled combatant. I got a feeling she's going to be more, more, more precise than I am. Okay, here we go. We are back, and I'm not seeing any combat. Oh look, there he is, over that way. Okay, cool. I'm about it. Where are you? Oh, he's coming in fast. Let's go. <laughs> All right, where's Lady? There's Lady Adventurous. All right, cool, cool, cool. There's not much in. Oh, 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 the, the re return fire has happened. Let's uh, also try and get involved here. I just bounced off him. I really did. The, um, oh, I know what's happened here. My camera has got a little bit too, uh, too low down, so I wasn't quite sure where I was pointed. Come on, yeah. All right. First bit of proper combat taken care of. Woo-wee. All right, I'm about it. I'm about it. What are we going to pick up here? A new chain gun turret. Uh, another thing I want to do, let's try this, let's try this. Let's um, press F and go orders, salvage. What are you going to do? 
She's going to... Yeah, there we go. All right, off, off, off they go. Oh, that's, that's really cool. Like, really cool. Like, really, really cool. I like that a lot. Oh, she'll even go around and blow up the wreckage that I was trying to blow up. Oh, that's that's kind of cool. That's very cool. Okay, your ship in this sector cannot find any more wreckages. That's fine. I would like you to escort me. And we're going to go pick up the other mining ship that also can't do things that uh, it had been asked to do. All right, back into this sector with all the mining ships. Let's press the F. Let's go orders. Please escort me. Wonderful. Now, I'm going to try and head south. Uh, I know that's totally the opposite way from where the galaxy, the center of the galaxy is, but there's that dark, dark, dark nebula over there. What's this? What's this? What's this? Incidentally, if you're struggling to see the pathways of your gates here, if you press control, it moves all your icons up above. Uh, pirates are attacking the sector. That's fine. I want to actually go down to Astral Legacy Beta. Oh, we're looking at it anyway. Beautiful. Beautiful. Small, small pirate attack over there. Not bothered. Not bothered. Okay, through the gate. What are we going to find on the other side? Well, actually, we've been this way before. I believe it to be an empty sector. Yeah, pretty much. Pretty much an empty sector. Let's go south, southeast. Because Wait, wait. the other one just disappeared. What? Hey, what happened to the other gate? No, it's over there, look. Why would it do that? Oh, I don't know. That's because I'm scrolled all the way down. Ah, okay, I see what happened there. We do have a few things. Wait, where are my other ships? Why are they taking so long? Wow, they, they really did take a while. Oh, well. Traveling at a fairly sedate pace. This guy still dropped massively behind me. I think I'm going to have to put more more engines on my little mining ship back there. Hmm. Uh, control and mouse, if you're wondering what spins my camera around like that. Just press control. Okay, the ships were with me this time. Well, at least one of them were anyway. Oh, here comes the other one. Cool, cool, cool. Where does that go? That's the south gate. Let's check the map once more. Oh, it goes exactly where I want it to go. Unless it jumps all the way over. Uh, what what else? According to form, blah, blah, blah. Shipyard down there. Okay, this is cool. Let's press F9 and have a quick look. Literally only a shipyard. Okay, fair enough, I suppose. <laughs> I, w I wonder if I can trick the ships. If I very quickly go and boost around the back of this gate, are they going to try and fly through it to get to me? This is a question I have. It's a strong possibility. Here we go. All right, let's press F9 and see if they do indeed fly through the gate. And if they do, like, do they go through it? Yeah, they do. Okay. Oh, I it lost its track of me. Oh, that's a bit of a shame. All right, we'll have to go through and grab it again. But, uh, okay, that's interesting. That's interesting. It's nice that it is just, you know, location-based instead of only working because we gave it an order, right? No, oh, we're on the other side. And look, we can't actually click in there to teleport. Oh, that's that's weird. Enter coordinates into the nav computer. There are rifts in the space-time continuum ox uh, uh, blocking access to this sector. Wow. Wow. And well, now we know that is a space rift. Whew. Okay, while well, I figure out what to do, I'm going to tell the little mining ship to go off and be mining. And I'm going to tell this ship here... Whoa, easy there, buddy. This ship here to... Oh, no. I didn't, I didn't want to be part of you. Ah! And tell this ship here to... I mean, do I patrol or do I salvage? I think what we're going to do is tell it to salvage. And it's going to be like, oh, I can't do nothing. I don't know where anything is. But we'll, we'll try that in a second. Try that again in a second when the pirates turn up. Oh, interesting, interesting. So this station by the Hikau is different from this station by the Ipawop. If that's how you pronounce that. I suppose that kind of just leaves us with one more thing to take care of. I have been talking quite a lot about the scrap that we currently have inside our inventory. Is this this one over here? No, it's not this. Which one's the ship inventory? Cargo. There we go. Cargo. Uh, you've got some scrap iron and scrap titanium. I'm headed towards this resource depot to go and deal with that. But something else at the end of the episode here whilst I am talking about it. I've literally just had a bit of an informal poll inside my Discord asking people that watch Devorian whether they would like music in it or not. Now, it turns out that the actual music for of Orion, very YouTube um, YouTube spiky at the moment, I suppose is the way to word it. It's uh, getting quite a lot of um, copyright strikes, etc. Uh, and I would lo not like to have that. But of course I can put generic space music in the background. So if you would like to sit, hear that, please let me know down below. Uh, I've left these past few episodes blank because uh, people like to listen to their own music or something in the background. I don't know. But talking about Discord, people said, hey, could we please actually have the music? So yeah, I'm going to put some music in. Let's do this. All right, I want to refine some raw ores. But more importantly, I want to refine these scraps 
here. So we went around, we did a little bit of salvaging, and we have got picked up these scrap irons and scrap uh, scrap titanium. So there is a way of going all and then going start, and you can see that all of it got processed pretty quickly. We didn't quite get the full amount. We've lost one on each one, but yeah, that's fine. We'll take these and do like that. And with that, I am going to say thank you very much for joining me for this adventure, ladies and gentlemen. I will see you next time when we're going to carry on back towards the center of the galaxy rather than flying away from it as we have been doing. Let me know what you guys think of the music and I will see you then when we're going to do that. Bye.